bigger, better, or if no. or is or is even your your stack of achievements better than where I am at now? I.e., looting in the Premier League versus yeah. ex Premier League winner Blackburn. Who's better and who's bigger? Does that matter? Does does Blackburn having been a winner make them bigger than Luton? And Luton in the Premier League right now, does that make them bigger than Blackburn? Where does what does bigger mean? Yeah, brother. They, as they always say, the best presents come in small packages. <laughs> so, <Yeah>. so <laughs> what that. does that mean? Does that mean Bayern Munich, Real Madrid, Inter Milan, Ajax, all them man, they are rubbish? No, they're big. So what is? Why no, did no, you no, say no. that? No, because as I said, then you had um, small clubs like Villa, who are yeah. who got a great track record and they've got historical things. They've won trophies and they've won the European trophy. That's like they yeah. make them less than uh, less than Leicester. They're be- they're bigger than Leicester. They're bigger than Leicester. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Villa's bigger than Leicester. Yeah, Le- Leicester just recently Leicester won just the had a, Leicester just and had it, a, cur- a current win. That's it. Right, as I said, but you, so. I said that about Everton. In the in the last couple of topics, and you said, "Yeah, that was time ago." So I can say that about Villa. That was time ago. We bring that look, up. For? But, but look, look, but look at Villa showing today. They got beat Villa, yesterday. They got beat yesterday. But you know what? But I hear what you're saying. Five. I hear what you're saying. And they're gonna be there. I don't know. If you if you watch if you watch the highlights, Leon played very well yesterday. It's just yeah, but fireman lost. Biele, oh my you, yeah, fireman Biele, are you me, yeah, man? Me. So, and they got good manager at Villa. So Villa currently. Because they do, they are better than any of the Midland clubs right now. So what is what does biggest club mean then? Does that just mean commercial? But who? But whose definition of bigger? What are we? Are we what, how are we speaking? Is how we talking in terms of? Because you know, when you say it, when you say, if I said to you, name me five of the biggest clubs in the world, you're gonna name Real Madrid, Barcelona, Man United, Liverpool, Bayern Munich, maybe, right? AC Milan. AC. See, you know the teams because they're the big boys. Because they've been because they've been shown to us because they they win. That's what I'm saying. They're the big they wins. They win. They win. And when you win, but it affects everything. If, you, if, if we're going to have to take in everything, so everyone's history, Leicester and them don't even get into the conversation before Villa and them. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's what they're I'm saying. Villa. When you've got stuff stacked up, you can come into the conversation because I've done all this. It might have been a long time ago, but I did it. It's, it's set in stone, but it's in the record books. And that's what counts. Because yeah, I, mean, I, you know, now that we're talking and it is sports, I think it's only football that say, yeah, but have you won like now? Did you win last year? 19 long time lately? don't count. But yet in different sports, 19 long time count. Yeah, but well, you know, which, which, when we go to the NFL segment, we, 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 please remind exactly. me about what you just said here. Exactly because right there. It, NFL, yeah, you can say that right now. Can, well, because, can, because, can, the uh, Oakland, can the Oakland, I know they're in Vegas now, but can the Oakland Raiders bring up Oakland, the Oakland days. Can they, they bring, can bring up? it up? But it, 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 it can bring it up, but it doesn't really account for nothing. Why? You, uh, it doesn't really. It should account because you're historically where you built, how you come up, yeah. what you have to endure. Especially Those, as there's no relegation over there. What, what else are you doing? Relegation. Oh, Bucket club's gone. <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's not relegation, though, is it? No, if it was a, a relegation situation, Dallas would have been well relegated. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying. No, I'm saying they haven't got relegation, so. You have to count everything because no one goes anywhere. We're right. all here. So, uh, so, so, like you said about bigger, it means. You I, say I, bigger I, means think, I think we do that in this country because we have relegation. Now that Blackburn is not in the Premier League, no one cares that they won. Only they care. You're That's not right. here. But it's in I the think, record books. I we don't people, care, but it's in the record books. Yeah, I think people count being here more. Than records, and I don't know if that's right. But be, but being here, be, being here in the here and now. Yeah, I think people count that more important than history. No, but you, you if you if you don't count the history, then you can't go forward to be where they are because you have to start with something. You have to you have to have a launch pad. Why? It's like in the Premiership, any manager or any player that puts on a Liverpool shirt, a Man United shirt. Do you know what that means? You, you, you're not just turning up from where you're coming from. This is not your old club where you play. You, no, bro. This is a different team here. Because, brother, because this is what they do in it. Like they do in the NFL or college. This is what they do. They sit you down in a class. You meet a few of the old players and they sit you down in a room and you sit down and you watch the history of this Ross Clark ball club, what it means to have this shirt on. So you know you're engrossed in this now. So you just know before you sign, 
Know what you're signing up signing up to, bro. Yeah. Know right. what you're signing up to because it's, it, it's you're right. I don't you know what I don't, I don't think they do that at most clubs now. In my in my mind, maybe they do it at every club. I don't want to say they don't, but in my mind, it feels like I know they're gonna take the, the Arsenal new signings through the marble floors. I know that. I know so when they go to Man United, they're gonna take them when, yeah, where Sir Alex has been at. Liverpool, they're going to take them where Shaq yeah, all their man is. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Newcastle, all you got to do is walk around and you know where I'm going. That's um, right. Maybe Villa as well, Birmingham, they're going to show them, yo, because the, the, the stadium has, hasn't changed that much since they've been Villa, winning. They played all the semi-finals. So, and remember that. So it's like certain clubs, yeah, but I think other clubs are like, yo, come sign this thing, you the man, let's go. And then them man think that they run the thing. No, no like there were greats here before you. Before you, and you need to know is. that you know well, what I'm saying, that, that, that's, and that's the whole point of getting the, the, the shirt numbers. Like, you know, raw, I'm wearing so and so shirt, it's not but, your shirt, that's someone else's that, shirt, exactly. And, and which goes back to which goes, which brings, which brings me into the, the, the segment of this NFL. Now, in the NFL or in, co- in college football, if you're that great, your shirt number gets retired, no one can't wear your shirt again. Yeah, done. Yeah, if that's if you know when they retire, that's it. Now I go to a player named Michael Irving. Yeah, played the Dallas Cowboys, uh, Miami Hurricanes. Now in in Dallas, number eighty eight shirt is a symbol of Dallas. Mm. Number eighty eight of all the shirt numbers at the Dallas Cowboys, number eighty eight is the most revered number. So who first wore it? Oh God, who first wore that shirt? Hugh Pearson. Drew Pearson one first wore that shirt and made some great catches. Now he just the other day he they inducted him to the Hall of Fame, which was a shambles, but they did they did it anyway. Lit better late than never. But so they went to retire his shirt, but then he's like, right, we'll retire your shirt. So when Michael Irving comes now, yeah, because that shirt's retired now. That no one can't wear it until you are a proven person to wear this shirt. So Michael Irving gets selected in the 1989 draft. So when he comes, he follows Drew Pearson. Yep. He throws Drew Pierce and says, boy, can, boy, I'd like to wear your shirt. It's like Will Smith when he played Ali. He had to phone Ali. When the people are come to me with the script, he's like, brother, before I even take the script, I've got to speak to Muhammad Ali first. <laughs> before straight. I do this. I'm not just taking, I'm doing this role. I have to speak to my. So there's that number eight years. So, so there you go. See? About the, so you, said, you, see what, you see what it says there? Pressure of wearing number 88. Yeah. That's saying come like you just said. You see that? You see the pressure, what it means? Because yeah. that shirt, that shirt is is the is the yeah is the, that come is the, that come like um the the Man United number seven in it yes George Robson, Best one it Cantona and all them thing there George yeah Best, exactly so yeah. really Best, truly yeah, that shirt yeah. should have been retired when George Best wore it that shirt should have been retired yeah and I only think, Best, uh, you know what I think here what we do is you have to li- if you can live up to that number you can rock no, the number no 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 you retire it first. But, you retire. No, I, I, I hear what you're saying, but look at the number seven. So you got George, Man United, George Best, yeah. Eric Cantona, yeah. Robson. All them men deserved that number seven, right? They're all good enough. Yeah, well, that, well that was, is that, I'm saying that number seven should should, should now be retired. Oh, oh, I, no, wait, wait, wait. Oh. I, get, I get what you're saying. You're saying Best should have retired it. Then yeah. Cantona phones Best. Can I wear your shirt? Yes. yes. No, no, he no, no, wears the club, it, the club was retire in, it again. Yes, yeah, they then... ask him, yeah, what, shirt, what number shirt would you want to wear? I hate you. And I would say, boy, my shirt's really seven, but you may have got it retired. And the man with, you know, the executive was, you know, oh, I'll tell you what, we'll get George on the phone. Beep, phone up George, George, watch out. I've got Eric Kenton out here. Hey, Eric, see you there. Ah, uh, <laughs> George uh, Benz. You, know, you know, I like your number. You know, I always wear number seven. <laughs> yeah, you know, I wear number seven. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> come, it's, come, let me take a pause here because you're talk- right, cool. I'm in my bathroom. Take a quick. Five or jungle is another place. Five, eight, seven TV. I hate that. Yeah. What's up, people? Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel.